So I don't know if you guys know. Um, you don't have to go to a spider island. You can make any island, basically any island, into spider island, because uh, they have to spawn bugs, and there's a way to do it. I'll show you how. Oh, there's a huge water. Oh, it's koi pond area. Yo, but we got an animal friend though. First of all, 4,000. Oh, come on. I think I know this koala friend though. Eh? Where did she go? Huh? She actually disappeared? Oh, what? Oh, no, I don't know her. Are you a dude? You have a mustache. Oh, no, no. Melba? I don't... I have... I have never heard of Melba. I don't think I've ever seen anyone with Melba. No, this is Koi Pond Island. <laughs> But if I invite Melba to my island, won't Melba take the camp area and I won't be able to have Anka in my town? How does that work? They will move into a plot you might you mark out. They will move into the campsite. Oh, should we have? Should we have her? Is she nice? <laughs> she seems nice. Is she? Would you recommend? Get her. She's adorable. Okay. Okay. Melba, would you like to move in? <gasps> Dude! Her phrase is toasty! Poggers! Tony! Tony! You have to marry Melba! You have to marry Melba. Her catchphrase is toasty, dude. That's perfect. It's meant to be. Straw coat? What the heck is that? Straw coat? <laughs> Excuse me? What the heck? Isn't this for PUBG? Okay, so we're gonna make this into Spider Island. We have to cut down all the trees. Basically, we have to make this island so that only the ground bugs spawn. And one of the ground bug is the spider. And we have to pick up all the flowers. And destroy rocks as well. There's no need to pick up the weed. <laughs> I'm just accidentally picking up the weed while I'm doing it. 
Exactly. Basically clear out the whole island so that the only thing that will spawn is the ground bugs. Because there is a tier list for the bugs. And if there is like... So like how the island works is that they will spawn one tier... Maybe not one, but maybe they will spawn like two tier five ground bugs um if there is no flowers or trees or the rocks and then if there are like trees then they will spawn maybe like uh grade five tree bugs Etc. Etc. You get it. Oops. So the best island to do this is the bamboo island because there is no water in the middle. So you get a huge area like a land area that will spawn the spiders and the spiders spawn three by three tiles anything less is too small to spawn the spiders and they spawn off the camera so you cannot just stay in like a huge area you have to roam like you have to walk around so that they will so the creatures spawn when your camera is not on screen That's basically the gist of it. And if you literally min-max the game and abuse this system, you can easily make 5 million bell in a day. Because when you empty out your pocket and uh, just catch the whole spiders and bring it home, you make about less than 500,000 bell but you can practically do this to all the islands so as long as you have enough miles for it then you can farm it farm the heck out of it <laughs> ah! now it stung me Whatever, I'll just make the medicine. Wait, I'm not here to make five million bells or whatever. <laughs> I just used all my money today to buy all the turnips. That's why I'm doing this so I can have some money <laughs> to actually do some stuff. Like, I could easily abuse this you know what i mean and get just just make like easily 500 or easily make 5 million bells per day for just sinking a few hours a day but <clears throat> like i said that's not the point of the game at least that's not how i play this game like with this method you, you basically have infinite amount of bell you just need to input enough time to grind it and i just find that really boring so i'm only gonna do it like not just today but like days that i literally have no money <laughs> i'm not even gonna like abuse it so i can get maximum house upgrades because i don't really care about that either Once you pick once you pick up everything, you just uh just 
just put the items on the ground. Because you don't really need wood. I mean, you can get wood back home. So you don't really need it. The fish doesn't matter. So you don't have to chase the fish away. Fish have their own spawning algorithm, I guess. Do we destroy the rock? Nope, we have to destroy the rocks. The reason why we need to destroy rocks, because as you can see, like it spawns bugs when you hit the rock, so that's why. the koala friend she's she's gonna be witnessing me fainting a lot i'll be fainting a lot from trying to catch the spider she's gonna be like she invited me to her island to live with her and she has been trying to catch the spider and she's been fainting like 10 times do i really feel safe <laughs> to go to her island isn't she a maniac? Why does she keep doing this to herself? Oh no. Do I have enough sticks? I do. Yeah, you can dig up the... So, you know, like I said, 3x3 three three square is how... Like, 3x3 three three square is where the spider spawns. Um, you can... Ma basically make a shape. Like, L shape. So that when the tr uh, spider spawns, it spawns... Like inside of the L so it cannot jump at you and it's like so you can just catch it without getting stung but that's all the babies do it that's like way too min maxi for me we live for the thrills Okay, you have a baby. It's okay. I don't have a baby in game. Yeah, you could also run around to give enough space between you and the spider. But that requires you running around. And whenever, like, the wharf things spawn, you have to unspawn them. Because you don't want them. You want the spiders. She's like, oh, all the trees are gone. She must hate nature. It's not a very good first impression, let me just tell you. Hey, would you like to live in my island? Let me just faint a couple of times and destroy literally everything on this 
island. But we're okay. I promise I'm not a crazy person. Don't watch me. Don't watch me destroying the nature. I'm not proud of it. I think this is the last rock. Oops. And I think we got some palm trees. Once I catch maximum amount of spiders, then I will end the stream. It might take me some time because I have never done it before and I suck at catching spiders okay do we destroy all the trees here Bond. Oops. Caught it. I think it, it was literally a second away from hitting me. <laughs> I think I got really lucky. everything right and despawn all the oh yeah 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 scare the fuck out of me dude what no what dang it <laughs> ah! it's uh it's gonna happen a lot don't worry chat that's just one out of many. Whoops. So now we drop all the items that we don't want. How much is the spider? How much is the spider again? Should I let go of the butterfly? Because the butterfly is... 4,000, right? 8,000? Okay, so I should let go of that butterfly then. You know what? Actually, it could spawn here. Let me just drop it in the water. Because <laughs> they don't spawn in the water. Er, the sandy area. myself too hard on catching spiders I'll just have this butterfly just in case so despawn those beetles ah so we have to go up there and despawn that beetle too hello despawn you 
I think the the ground mole is okay. It doesn't overlap with the spider. Oh, this spawned the wharf. Correctly, I caught one. It's one, two. It's one, two. Not O2. Oh, two. One, two. <laughs> it's gonna. It's gonna happen a lot, chat. Just say it's gonna happen a lot. I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm freaking scared. <laughs> Dude, just like instead of a calm music, if you put like some scary music, um, I'll be dying. No joke. The spiders spawn at night. Uh, spawn at seven until four a.m. So yeah, night time. Is there a wharf? Oh. Go away. I'm so scared. Where is this spider? Where are you? Oh my god! Beetle, get out, get out, get out, I don't need you. Another beetle, get out, get out. I don't need that. Okay, it's gonna spawn soon. The spider's gonna spawn soon. Ah, why is the... Keep no, I don't want the beetle! No wharf! No, no! Give me the spider. Why are you keep spotting me these garbage? <laughs> I don't want these, please. Give me the actual spidey. Oh, no, 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 it can spot like from far away where I can see and like, yeah, 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 that's a beetle, that's a beetle, that's a beetle, go away, go away. Two, 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 two. That's so scary! Die, guy, guy, go away, beetle. Why am I so scared? <laughs> Cause it literally jumps at me when it sees me, it like jumps. And it spawns in front of me! Oh, the beetle spawned on top, so I have to go up top. Go away, go away. If it doesn't jump, then I think I will get not spooked out. But it literally jumps at me. What the fuck? Oh, there it is! There it is! There it is! Catch it! Woohoo! See, that's not scary. Like, it spawned kind of far away from me, so I was able to see it. That's why it didn't scary. It, 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 it didn't scary? It didn't scary? 